Hello. Hey. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's vlog. So we are doing a weekend in my life because we have a lot to do this weekend. I'm actually about to be 39 weeks pregnant. So we're trying to just like wrap up, you know, pretty much the last things we need to do before the baby gets here. But first thing on our agenda today for this weekend is we need to do a feed run because this is probably our last like big-ish feed run before the baby gets here. We do already have a bunch of feed in the barn for the horses at least, but for the other animals, we definitely need to re-up and we are out of hay today. So we are in the truck, we are on the way to Tractor Supply because I also have a 10% off coupon for Tractor Supply. So I wanna take advantage of that, of course, but I wanna make sure that we're prepared so that when the baby does get here, um, Mike doesn't need to just be running out all the time and go getting feed. So we just wanna get some last minute things. And plus, after the baby gets here, I probably won't be going into tractor supply for quite a bit. So I wanna soak it all in and smell all the things that I like to smell and do everything in tractor supply that I like to do. So anyways, we're just gonna go ahead and get right into this weekend vlog. Look how expensive horse feed is getting. $295.99. <laughs> um, I really think that's a little bit of a typo, but what is going on over here? Let's hope it's a typo. First thing is horse feed. Got it. Got the last two bags of the pig feed. This tractor supply like hardly ever has our pig feed, so a success. Now we just need like necessary feed would be the chicken feed. So chicken feed, it's all on a sale today too, guys. Wow, we are really doing good because I have a five dollar coupon off plus my ten percent plus this is on sale, so that's exciting. Now I just need one more bag, but it looks like they only have one. Oh no. We got all of our feed that we sort of needed at Tractor Supply. They're always out of stuff, so. We got what we could get, but now we are going to the second feed store to get our hay. And then we're gonna go see Miss June, so I'm pretty excited about that. She actually needs grain, so we're bringing her grain. But I do think that by like the end of this week, I think I'm gonna take her home, because I definitely wanna bring her home before I have the baby, so that's probably the plan. horse tack very soon now I'll be back in the game <laughs> All right, hay is strapped down. Time to go see my girl. We're pulling up to the barn to see Junie. I'm so excited. I haven't seen her in probably a week or two now, just because I haven't really had the energy to come out here. So I'm very excited to see her. Look who it is, guys. I never see her look through this window whenever we come here. But she's not often in her stall when we come here, and of course now she moved away from us. But Miss June is in her stall. Junie! There she is. Hi, Junie B. We have a hay delivery for Junie. It's not hay, it's grain. <laughs> Whoops, sorry, Mike. Hi, baby. Mommy misses you. 
Stretch out your eye. Looking pretty good. Nice. Do you miss us? Do you miss us? Yes, you do. You know who we are. <laughs> Jenny, do you miss me? She's like, no. That's what we should get for our hay instead of those. The feeders? Peaches. Those? What do you guys think about these hay feeders? If you guys have them, let me know. Jenny! Jenny girl! Oh, I miss her so much. Guys, do you think she still remembers me? What do you think, Mike? Yeah. Hi, pretty. Do you know who we are? That's your buddy. <laughs> Bye, Jenny girl. Hi, baby. We see you soon. Bye, pretty. Guys, look at our little ducks. They're starting to look more like mallards. They're not little anymore, but they are so cute. So these are the babies of Mrs. Butters and Alfred. So, so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, look who it is. Hi, monster. Here's a better look. Oh my gosh. It is day two of this weekend vlog. And we kind of cut yesterday kind of short because it started to rain and I got really tired. Ended up working in like the house for a bit with like the nursery and such. But we are back out in the barn today trying to get a bunch of stuff done. So first thing is something that I cannot do is put all of our feed where it needs to go like in the feed bins and such this morning. So that's what we're doing. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. I see some ears. Good morning. So he's just doing the pig food for now because our pig food was empty. But that's the extra horse feed that we are not going to put in the bin because there's really no room right now. So we just have some extras there, but pig feed is nice and filled. So we have to move the hay today over there, but there's a lot of hay mess. And we kind of have a bit of a mess in the alleyway. Mike's picking up this tarp right now, but we need to go ahead and clean the alleyway a bit, get this hay cleaned up so that we can move the hay. Now that the alleyway is pretty much broomed out, I'm going to blow it out in a minute, but the horses are currently eating right now, and now it's time to tackle all of this hay. is all cleaned out we left miss broody so i'm gonna change her name to it's no longer petrolina it's miss broody hay is moved back petro's unharmed pallet jack Park. where it needs to go <laughs> parks next thing these chicks need their little i don't want to call it their coop but they need it clean we got to add a little bit more bedding they're getting pretty big so soon we'll be able to move them but we only have three in there and That'll be it for our chicks for this season, I think, unless Petro hatches us out any. But it's a clean there little area and they'll be good. The white ones are so dirty looking because <laughs> our other birds sit on this coop or this cage and gets them dirty. So they need a refresh. So we're just gonna take them out of here. Mike's gonna put them in the little incubator coop that's not turned on. But it's just for a couple minutes so we can clean out their coop. God bless you. Oh my goodness. I know. Chicken dander desk. This is why I'm not doing this. Is uh, 
probably not the best thing for you at all, actually. Mike is taking one for the team. That's a very nice little blackbird. Ah, it's escaping. One in. It's okay. Ah, oh my gosh. All right, last one, the smallest one. Oh, that was not too bad. All right, everybody in for just a minute. On to the pile it goes. Yuck. <laughs> Their coop cage has new bedding in it. It's nice and cleaned out. Broomed it all around here. Blew it out as much as we could. Now we're going to put these guys back in there and get them their food and water set up. So the barn is looking really good. So super successful ending pretty much here to our workload for the weekend. So everything's been broomed out. Horses are out. And we're not going to work on it this weekend, but June will be coming home in the next week. So we don't want Dinky to not have a stall. So what we're going to do later this week, Mike is going to take a skid steer, going to scrape everything out. We're going to get it down to dirt. And since we have so many extra rubber mats, we are going to make it look like an official stall with all the rubber mats. So we'll put all the rubber mats in here and then we'll get shavings and we'll set this stall up to properly look like a literal horse stall so that Dinky can go in here every day because that's kind of how her routine is. She's been in June stall. So now she's very used to this because she's on the same schedule with the horses. So when June comes back, June will get her stall back and Dinky will have this stall. We've been working all morning. So we decided that we're gonna go take a little ride <laughs> to cool down a bit before we finish up all the work we're doing. We just got back from our ride on the side by side, let the pigs out so that they could enjoy the day with the goats and eat some grass. Look at Stewie. Stewie's like not having it with Willie right now. Well, I'm super hot now. We've worked so hard this morning. As you can see, my face is very flush from the sun. So we're gonna go in the pool now and just kind of relax for the rest of the day because I definitely don't have as much energy in me as I have in the past. So if you guys like coming along for this weekend vlog with us, Make sure you go into this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below. Make sure you turn on those post notifications so you don't miss any videos like this because this morning I was actually filming a morning routine and you guys will see that. I really like the routine that I filmed. So anyways, you guys, we love you and we'll see you in the next one.